Cattle and hogs, what do you got? Yep. Um, in the cattle market, we traded a little bit higher in cash last week. Uh, 190 in the north, 186 in the south, $313 for boxes now. Uh, we don't tend to stay above that level, and due to the seasonality where we are right now, I would say within the next week or two, we might start to see those boxes soften just a little bit. Weights were up uh, three pounds week over week and 33 pounds year over year, so we're really not lacking beef production. We were down 1.2 percent year over year, uh, week over week, 1.3 percent year over year. So very minuscule changes in comparison to you know down eight, nine, and 10 percent in cattle placements. Uh, we are. The marketings are very, very low now, so there's not, you know, really all that much. We have ground down into a point in which the industry is trying to ration cattle and ration beef, so we either, A, don't run out of it or push the price so high we kill the consumer demand. Yeah, that's my worry. I mean, I've been asking this to a few other folks already this morning. Are you concerned about these prices running away from the consumer's wallet? You know, we are in one instance where we can't ever seem to find that price that, that things just shut down. It's always a combination of other factors that come with it. So we already have real high beef prices. Were something else to come into the consumer's life that they have to adjust for, then those type items, the beef items, the desirable items, they can kind of be set off to the sideline for a little while to, in order to have enough money to pay the other. But again, as you're probably going to talk on the cow guy, and you have, that people don't seem to care anything about that. They seem to be in a spending frizzing frenzy like I've never seen before. Well, I mean, they're <laughs> <laughs> They're just looking at Congress, and Congress yeah. and the consumer are spending the yeah, same. Yeah, absolutely. Right? If government can spend it, why can't I? <laughs> right. And, and I think, and that to your point, though, it makes you have to kind of take a look at that as as, as a rancher because you've got, you know, TGI Fridays looking for a buyer now. They mm -hmm. got Red Lobsters going out of business right. now that they sell that beef. But I mean, the restaurants. Oh, and we had a report out from in, uh, New York and New Jersey restaurants have seen a, a drop off in the first quarter, and they use the word plummet as mm -hmm. far as customers coming right. in. Right. So, there's something going on out there. We have to kind of make sure we're, we're absolutely, aware of it. And, and beef prices and cattle prices very, very high. Yep. So.